What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? Hope you're doing very well. Simulation for the nation here and welcome. Welcome to No Man's Land. But different to any of our other series we're doing on here, this is our crossplay server. The dedicated server, a 16 slot dedicated server that is up and working right now. And you can join in if you are playing on either PC or PlayStation or Xbox. So you can, you are welcome to come and join in. We have done a little bit of work here, myself and my server admins to get this all set up, ready to go. Uh, we bought a sawmill because we've been felling trees. We put up a little bit of a yard there, which will no doubt expand. We got some hens, a proper little homestead on the go, which is great. So right now you can see there's a few things happening. We're going to get stuck in to help out with some of that in a little bit. Uh, we're, we're not doing too badly for money. We could always do with more. But you'll see that we have some fields here as well. So we were able to take on field 30, well, plus 36. Plowed out one area here and plowed out this area. We've got oats and beans in there because that's all we can plant right now. Uh, and then we also bought field plot 46. And we're starting to get some work done here as well, which is fantastic. So we've really got some uh, some areas to work into. 46 has some forestry ground that we haven't even started with there yet either, which I love. Uh, and all this needs really now is you to come on board and help us out here. Now, people have been asking how we're going to do this. I am going to leave this open to anyone to play. However, if there is, uh, if the server is full and one of my members would like to get onto there, members do take priority. So they will be uh, having special uh, preference uh, to get onto the server there. So you don't have to be a, a, server, a, a dedicated member uh, of the channel to play. But if you are one, you will get priority to come on. Uh, so this is going to be open for everybody, uh, any platform there. If you want to join, quite simply, all you need to do is go and uh, sign up to my Discord server, which is down in the description below. Uh, put into there, in the comments there, that we are looking to, that you're looking to join. And then we will get you the permissions you need to come and join into our room. Uh, there's a private Discord room there, which will allow you access to see all of the server information only. Uh, so that's what we're going to be looking to do. So uh feel free to come on down we currently have five tractors they're all pretty small and all are under 100 horsepower uh of course we've got a couple of masses here uh, a couple of masses there and a couple of the bureaus as well and that will give us enough to get going we'll, we are going to get more and more as we can especially as we start to get more people on board to get some driving done really because we're going to need them all there so we're just kind of figuring all that out really at the moment and seeing what's going to work right now i'm going to help out by selling a few bits and pieces here let's lift up my Let's lift up that. Get over to here. I'm going to sell some of these planks off that we continue to make because, well, planks planks mean money. No longer do points mean prizes, planks mean money. Uh, so we're going to sell these off at the store uh, so we can get a bit more in there. Maybe buy another plow or uh, get some fertilizer bottom, which we're going to need, judging by the looks of that. Uh, ground slowly coming along. There was a bit of an accident there with the pallet. We'll have to get that one shifted. Uh, have they been locked down? Yes, they have. Cool. And we'll get going. So it did take a little bit of time to get the server going. Uh, we have done it though. And I think it was very... It was good to wait for a, for a good map to come along. No Man's Land has some challenges to it. And it will allow us to really grow and grow and grow. And you know what? By the time we get this all finished. And by the time this map is firing. God, I'm going to feel really chuffed about it. It's going to be great. I cannot wait. Let's do a bit of that. That's better. And boom. Perfect. We might just knock that one on a bit more. Yeah, we, we've got a, a big appetite to get some real work done here, which is great. And I think the, the I've had my two admins who are on board at the moment, the Krabby and Ghoul have definitely... Go into forward gear, Massey. There you go. Have definitely put in a lot of hours thus far to get us to this stage. We've cleared a lot of trees there. We've got some uh, grass planted. Uh, what we can maybe look at doing is uh, actually mowing down this grass first. But, uh, you know, we can always come back to that one once we once we get all these crops in the ground and starting to grow for us. I also got to figure in that we don't really have any equipment to do that. So that is always going to be an extra cost to factor in. But we will be looking to do uh, a live stream on here every so often as well. I uh, hope to see you along for those as well there. You can obviously join in if the server's full. I've maximized the server storage space. So we are looking at 16 slots just so we can get as many people on here as possible. Lord, he knows what that will look like when we have... Uh, 16 on here and going strong but you know what i guess we'll find out uh no i'm just gonna stick these any old way on here just to say that they're on and that they're done let's go and get the next one 
but let me know in the comments if you are interested about joining here would love to see how many folks want to come along and have a bit of fun on here uh plenty of fun to be had oh these keep just uh, multiplying uh let's see how many trees we've got in here at the moment uh oh quite a bit of wood good effort guys good effort that's gonna get us a great amount of money still plenty of trees to go out there as well which is fantastic uh, i will be flipping between playing on pc and console to be honest there um on pc here at the moment but i will i have been on xbox on here a little bit uh just to get us all set up in a way it's a nice little change up really to be honest uh good to use the xbox still for something other than battlefield now and again and like i say we will be on this map for a while we've got quite a bit that we want to achieve here but then at some point we will be moving on to a next map when it comes around the corner uh the, the we're gonna have a different server which is the hardcore realism dedicated server uh that will be locked down a bit tighter there and that one will be uh moving on to a british map when it becomes available uh and i've got a few ideas as to what that might look like in the short term as well which i'm looking forward to yeah it's gonna be really cool really really cool to see Got up there see if there's any more pallets being produced and uh, bam there you go So there's always gonna be plenty of work to do what we'll find like i say we're trying to acquire as many different uh, tractors and bits of equipment as possible there we've got cheap cultivators we've got small cheap fertilizer spreaders as well because we really don't want to, oh lord really want to spend too much money on um you know big shiny equipment when we just don't need it yet uh, and this will give everyone a chance obviously you know at some stage we might need as many as up to 16 different tractors if we get that many people wanting to play so we've got to really be uh strategic with this which is why we just picked up the second block of land uh to give everyone some work to do here so that should be interesting to follow let's just take this one i think mm, sure that's kind of picked up a loop probably gonna be another one spawn there in a second up we go looks like my microphone's turned on the server uh now what we will be doing is having i mean you can use the in-game audio facilities as much as you would like to now it's not a problem at all in fact actively encourage it where possible uh when we do stream on it though i will probably just mute everything off just so it makes it a little bit easier for me to control audio oh lord that one's gonna go let me just uh Eesh. That, that one again oh, I'm gonna be a little bit careful with that Ooh. well it's not neat it doesn't really want to be neat I don't particularly want it to be neat I just want to get them out with here for today uh we will work on getting that load tied up a bit better in the future we're just going to give these to a gentle little tap where we can a bit like a bit more mm, kind of i guess not really and we'll do this one as well Well, we're not going on the main road, so we'll, we'll work with it. I think we will work with it. What I do need to do is shift that one. So I'm going to be able to do it that way. So we'll spike those. And then, yeah, Lord knows what the rest of it look like. We're going to get this all loaded in now, and then we'll take it away. And then I'm going to show you what the rest of our land looks like and also show you a very special point on the map uh, that you'll see as we go towards the store here. right then i think we're just about settled it's clearly apparent that servers still don't like pallets occasionally but we're, we're on we'll take the most of them away uh we'll keep just checking on that that will be one of the key jobs we have to do at the moment because like i say it's the only way you get any, any re uh, revenue coming in right now uh but needless to say we are we're looking good there we've got these two fields coming through looking good they'll be in need of some fertilizer soon we'll have to bring a little bit back 
Uh, and then we've just started to cut down some trees and also uh, get some land reclamation going here. Got a bit of plowing done. We do need a stump grinder by the looks of things. That's looking good. Lots of land for us to work on with. I wish we could just break down those stones. That'd be pretty neat. Clearly we'll have to do a little bit more work on that one. But yeah, there's a lot of stones coming through there, which will need our attention uh, and stumps to be ground out there as well. So we can definitely do that. Uh, so yeah, this is where we're going to be focusing a lot of our time, really. If you do fancy this, you want to get some work in, as always, like I say, Discord links down below. Mention there that you're looking to get onto the Deji server and then we'll get you access to the room you need to be in to uh, to get all of... So you can both chat about the uh, the, the Deji server, but then also to, to get the, the access that you need. Now, we are just approaching something here that is that we decided to put in. And this was something that was a unanimous decision, really. And it was something that we really wanted to do. And uh, all will become apparent in just a moment. As we pull over here, we have put in the monument here. Now, it wasn't necessarily something that we really ever thought we'd have to do. But unfortunately, we did. Uh, as I've mentioned recently, Martin Steiger was a really uh, integral member of the previous Deadly server, spending many hours on there and really building up to where it was. And his involvement uh, was a great part as to why it became so good, to be honest. The server was a real, uh, real important part of my channel there and it's something that I really enjoyed to be on. Uh, his particularly favorite tractor to, to drive was uh, an 8RX in 2019. So we, we thought it would be a great opportunity to, to bring this onto here. He particularly liked using the 8RX with a very small bit of equipment on the back. Hence the reason we have a 3 meter cultivator on there. Uh, so it is a standing memorial to, to Martin and all of his efforts there. I would like to think that had we been able to, to get this going and he was still with us, then no doubt he would have been able to come onto here and enjoy it as much as everybody else. Uh, there is a second farm on this map. It's called Martin's Farm. It's locked down, so nobody can get into it. This will be staying here regardless for the future. And I think it's a great idea that we've put it here. So uh, this is... He'll always be keeping an eye on us. And I don't think we'd have it any other way. So that is why we have a tractor there. Uh, now with that, we're going to go and sell the rest of this, these pallets off here. Before that, we lose that front one entirely by the looks of things. And then we're all looking good. Oh, we're about to lose it. About to go. There you go. I think. Better. Perfect. The planks are making us quite a bit of money, which is great. Like I say, we want we were up at around that we we've got a three hundred and fifty thousand pound loan. And that's it so far. We don't need any more, but we're just gonna try and make as much revenue as we can. Uh, and use, like I say, use the smaller, older equipment there where necessary and where, where we can do. And that's quite a frequent as well, to be honest. So we'll continue to do that where we can. So I'm happy with it all. I think it's making it looking like a very good solution. Oh, there go those pallets there. Let's just go back a little bit so we can sell off the rest of the ones on the front. Happy days. And then sell all these guys. Bingo! 10 grand! Love to see it. You love to see it. And there we go, folks. So I'm going to leave this here because we may well get some fertilizer to take back with us. Just a couple of bags to get those fields done. So I look forward to seeing you on No Man's Land where we'll be building up this huge uh, metropolis, really, of farming. Hopefully we'll get to that stage. It's going to take us time. It's going to take a lot of work, but it's going to be great to get it done. Uh, so if you do want to uh, partake, you know what to do. Follow the steps down below and we shall see you all on no man's land until next time do stay safe enjoy what you're doing as always and we'll see you in the next one